So before we get going here today, I gotta apologize. I'm running late with this video. I'm a day late. I do have a good reason, kind of. So we ran out of propane on the grill and it was yesterday, so it was Sunday. And so the propane place was closed. But I happen to know our Walmart will do trade outs if we bought tanks from them before, which I actually, actually had done in the past. So I take my tank out there. Guy comes out to get the tank, pulls a new tank out, hands it to me, and says, that feel full? I, I, I don't know if that feels full. And I'm sitting there, well, pretty heavy. So here, I'm grab another one, see how that one feels. And I went, whoo, <clears throat> and pulled the muscle from about my waistline to my shoulder blade. It wasn't that bad, I didn't think. I did set the bottle back down real quick and said, nope, this one's full enough, we're taking it. Well, as the day went on, it got worse and worse. <laughs> Until last night, whenever I was going to come out here and cut, I went to get out of my recliner and my legs just kind of wilted under me. So I decided I better just lay off and uh, see if I can get her done today. <laughs> Welcome to Smoky CNC Woodworks. I'm Brian and today we're gonna to do something just a touch different. I really haven't ever done this one before. Uh, I've seen them done. My wife's done them on her clothing and stuff and it's a, kind of a little thing that's been going on for a while. It's an initial sign and somehow they scrambled the initials. I don't I don't understand why we scrambled the initials. So if I was gonna do mine, my initials are JBM. However, if I was going to make one of these initial signs for me, it would read JMB. So you put your last name in the middle, your first name on this side, and your middle name on that side. I don't really understand the relevance of doing that, but apparently it's the fad or what they're wanting. And so I've had an order for one of these signs, and so I'm going to give it a shot and see how it cuts. Um, I'm hopeful that it's not gonna be so thin that this thing just didn't brittle. So we're gonna do a little initial sign, so let's go.
guys, that was it. That was one long, boring cut. <laughs> it was for me anyway, because you guys are seeing this at somewhere between four and eight times the speed that the machine actually runs, and it just kept going over the same thing over and over and over. So I'll show it to you real quick. I can't pick it up. It is still very wet. See, so this, this person's initials are MRB. So they do M, R over there, and B in the middle, B for the last name. I'm not going to say the name. This is for a young lady, and I just don't want to put her name out there. And, you know, she doesn't need any unwanted attention. I just got asked to make this for her by somebody else, and it's going to be a gift. And it apparently is a thing. I've got a niece that has one on her wall, so apparently they're a thing. Who knew? So y'all saw me doing a lot of cutting with the jigsaw there. When I do stuff like that and all those little pieces, I put things called tags in there and it leaves just a little chunk of wood. That way when the router's going around, it doesn't hit that and come flying out and hit me or get in there and get wedged and then just jack up the whole thing. I've had it happen. I just didn't put enough tags in and it messed it up bad. So that's what all that's about. And I mean, there were like, I don't know, 50 of them in that one. Just keeping all those little pieces intact so they wouldn't go zipping out or break part of it. So that's going to be about it for this one. And once again, sorry for being late, but I explained it earlier. It happens. This old thing's not made for all of us, I guess. <laughs> so guys, that's it. If y'all haven't done so yet, please subscribe, and I'll see y'all next time.